So I keep on getting burned by uh, production info leaking into my shit, so I'm doing this, so I gotta be careful, because uh, this was done for a project, so moving all these groups so I can start from scratch. So I'm gonna go Impact Origins, because that's what I need for... I don't even think I spelt that right. I gotta get my eyes checked. Yeah. So there we go. And I'm gonna... Particles per second, 25. And so that's gonna shoot shit uh, into the scene. And then we're gonna go surface position. And this is how I'm gonna lock uh, particles to the surface. So, node. Uh, position, surface position, hook up the node and then you have all these objects and it's gonna be by uh, material ID so I'm gonna go 5 or 8 whatever uh, impact origins particle particle uh, particle data position hook that up and alignment alignment because we need the surface normal so that's what we're doing here so let's see if this works um, uh, I've just selected the node and I'm selecting this as my node right there so wow look at that not work I hate that when that happens so I gotta I gotta pause and see why I can't see I got 22 particles in my scene Oh, I know why. Alright, so I'm going to go mesh select. And see the material? I have it set to 5. So that's what I do to, you know, select faces. And then I put a material on the object. And I change the ID to 5. See, subconsciously I knew, but I just missed. I lacked the motor skills. So, as soon as we do that, and it's still not working. Oh, I bet you it is, though. So, I'm going to pause this and figure out why I can't see my particles. Uh, had them on a uh, layer, uh, and the, the TP master system was on its own layer, and very frustrating. Very, very frustrating. You know, got to watch out for that shit, or you get burned. So, ticks, uh, I'm going to go take forces setting off. So now we got some green ticks on our shit. Uh, so how does, it, how does that go? I think they all uh, pop on. Uh, what's this happening here? So when does my system start? My system starts at 3.14, so I'm going to start it at uh, 3.30. It doesn't really matter uh, when, so... As you can see, they're uh, popping on. I moved my system start time to 3.30, just the beginning of it. So I'll just click animation instead. And there they go. They uh, pop on. So now that I have that, you know, it, it goes pretty quick. But what I want to do now is I want to cache this out to make it speedy. So. Um, I'm going to pause this because i got to keep the directory info hidden. Alright, so I navigated to a folder and I'm just going to save the TPS file out. And it's going to run that one through pretty quick. And now I have that cached and that's speedy. So that's the first step of this uh, project. So that shows you how to get stick... Um, particles to a selected face because I only wanted the impacts happening on the faces I wanted so I just selected them and put the material on top and uh, that is good to go kablam part one part two is next